Davening takeaway, Ligute Torah, Bamidbar, Daf Pehe, the 85th page. On the staff, and in, in, in much of the daf, there's a mimer that starts out with a pasuk, a verse from Ashrei, Eini Kelo Lecha Yisavivavata Nesai Lahem Es Achlum Biite, and which literally translates, "The eyes of all are anxiously um, yearning or, or waiting for you, Hashem." And then it's the, it finishes off, and you, Hashem, will then give the food in its proper time. The following Pasuk, open your hands and give and, and satisfy everyone, everyone with your, uh, your will. So these two Pasukim are the nature of the Mimer. And it is worth it to go through the mimer and see all the details for the, the full richness of it. But just to pull out uh, some thoughts to help us with the davening um, as a single small thought that when we say the eyes of all, the all word kol in Hebrew, chaf lamed, numerically add up to number 50, which represents the 50 gates of of understanding, the Nun Shari Bina. And the Mimer explains that when we do his boninus and we're meditating on Hashem and we take these concepts, especially of Hashem, very high lofty concepts, we want to bring it down. We don't want to leave it in the, the intellect, in the brain. We want to draw it down into the heart. But there are uh, different amounts we can draw it into the heart or different stages that could be drawn into the heart. And when it's not a complete drawing into the inner, you know, point of the heart, then it's referred to as kol. And so we are saying that Hashem, the when we are doing this boneness, we haven't quite been able to bring it into the deepest part of us, the deepest part of our heart. So we are uh, looking anxiously or expectantly at you, Hashem, to do that, and then you will then help us be able to bring it in to that deepest level. And that's also hinted at in the next pasuk when we say that, um, Hashem, open up your, your hands. The hands um, are formed in this way, in a way that it's like a, a vessel. We cup our hands in, in such a way that we retain and, and collect and that by, by asking Hashem that we would do this, Hashem will then satisfy with the rut zone, with will. What will is this that Hashem is satisfying us with? That is the supernal will, the rut zone as is mentioned in other davening takeaways. This is connected, this rut zone and realizing that rut zone is connecting what's called ruusa daliba, the the inner uh, desire of the heart. And that's that inner part that we asked in the last pasuk that we want, the, we are anxiously hoping that Hashem will then fill. And by Hashem doing this, answering our request, and through the davening, being able to get us to the point where it touches our inner part of the heart, that's that part that is, um, touches the essence of who we are, which then touches the essence of Hashem, which then allows that unity of Hashem that we can accomplish in the davening, which is bonding with Hashem in that essential way.